These are Sri Lankan nationals fleeing their homeland because of an economic crisis that is ongoing in their country right now. Our southern neighbour is facing an economic crisis because of shortage of fuel and essential commodities. The crisis is worsening. Inflation is at an all-time high. Inflation stands at 17.5%, higher since the year 2015. The repercussions of this crisis are now being felt in India. As Sri Lankans begin to flee the country, officials estimate that if this crisis continues and as many as 2,000 to 4,000 refugees may actually land up in India alone. How did things get so bad? What exactly then is the issue? Let's find out. Sri Lanka is in the midst of a severe economic crisis. This is the country's worst economic crisis since it gained independence in the year 1948. The crisis actually started last year, in the year 2021. This when the Sri Lankan government declared an economic emergency. The country was facing rising food prices, a sinking currency and rapidly dropping forex reserves. And the situation has worsened since then. The country is heavily dependent on imports. Sri Lanka is significantly reliant on imported goods. Among other necessities, it imports fuel, food, paper, sugar, lentils, medications and transportation equipment as well. The list is very long. Due to the lack of foreign cash, the country is now unable to import all of these commodities, many of them extremely essential. Tourism accounts for 10% of Sri Lanka's GDP. After a series of terrorist bombings in Colombo in 2019, tourism was already on the decline. The COVID-19 pandemic has aggravated this issue for Sri Lanka. In 2021, the Sri Lankan government decided to ban chemical fertilizers in order to achieve 100% organic agriculture. However, this decision impacted organic agriculture. The production was reduced by half. This then had a negative impact on the country's agriculture production, which then ended up having a negative impact on the country's agricultural economy and the economy overall. One of the major reasons for Sri Lanka's current situation is its massive foreign debt burden it owes to China. Sri Lanka owes over $5 billion in debt to China and is also paying an additional $1 billion loan to Beijing that it took in the year 2021. Apart from this, Sri Lanka also owes big money to India as well as Japan. With forex reserves dropping from over $7.5 billion in 2019 to around $2.8 billion in July 2021, Sri Lanka's foreign exchange supply was very, very badly hit. This meant that the amount of money that Sri Lankans have had to shell out to purchase the foreign exchange necessary to import goods increased, hence depreciating the value of the Sri Lankan rupee. Because of this economic nightmare, Sri Lanka has asked countries like China and India to step in and help out Sri Lanka. <laughs>